Hello, Just be every. Sure to scream if she starts killing you. Oh. Thanks. I feel so much better now. Hello, everybody. Everybody. Everyone. Doesn't matter. Welcome back to God of War Ragnarok. Uh, okay. This will probably be fine. Hey, Freya. What? Can't I pay an old friend a visit? Nothing wrong with that, right? I mean, just because I'm responsible for the death of your son doesn't mean... Okay, yeah. She probably avoid mentioning that. Is that Freya? Am I wearing this around my neck? The arrow tip that killed your son? That's a great question. Uh... I'm so dead. I mean, she was only attacking Kratos in the beginning, anyway. Oh, she's just right there. Does nothing. Sneaking up is not the way to do it, kid. Oh, she is sharpening a blade. Freya! You should have stayed with Sindri. Wait! Stop! Your father. Where is he? Not here! He sent you? No! He doesn't know! You shouldn't have come. He took my son. What Gosh. makes you think I won't do the same? Wow, she's... You're better than this! Quite deranged looking. Of course. Immediately. You would stake your life on it. <clears throat> what do you know of me? I know you haven't killed me yet. So while you're thinking it over, why don't you let me go and I can tell you why I came? You mean to plead for your father, save your breath. His fate is sealed. Well, you know who's to blame for everything. I cannot get to Odin, nor do I need to. Ragnarok will take him. Yeah? Well, what if I told you that he came to Midgard? He came to us. Offered peace if we don't move against him. Ooh. Claims Ragnarok's already been averted. He lies. Maybe. But if you know Groa's prophecies, you know it depends on an army of giants. The giants wait for war in Jotunheim. No. I've been there. There is no giant army. There are no giants at all. Just me. You. <laughs> Jotunheim, you learn the truth. My mother was the last guardian of our people in Midgard. And and that's not all. The giants have prophecies about me. They know me as... Oh, she is not okay. Loki. I think maybe I'm supposed to help stop Odin. Somehow. But since all the giants are dead and you won't fight Odin. And he's already won. Why aren't we working together? Now that you can fight again! I am far from whole! Oh. Okay. Okay. You're gonna tell her about Tyr at least? But we found Tyr. Yeah. That's a big one. Maybe if you spoke to him. Tyr is alive? Yeah. We... we broke him out of Svartalfheim. Impossible! The Nine Realms are closed to all! No. We opened up the way. We just don't know where to go next. But if we all Atreus, band together... this is such a bad now, idea. Enough! Oh. All 
All right, I think this conversation is over. Leave this place. Go and do not return. Go before I change my mind. Do not expect the same mercy for your father. Well, that was... See, all that happened there is you told her some important stuff and you lost your little necklace. I'm sure there will be repercussions. Ooh, that's quite a lot of experience for a little Atreus. I guess he's not little anymore. He's he's actually quite a bit taller than he was in the first game. Wait, what? Bow ability? What? Yeah, I know how that works. Oh, I can upgrade it. Oh. Ew, there's lots of things to do with him. Okay. Oh, wait, 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 so wait, I'm wait. Not dead. Almost missed that. Didn't get any answers. So this all might have just been a very big waste of time. Which I will never, ever admit to Sindri. And Freya's, ugh, that, that thousand yard stare she had. She wasn't even looking at Atreus. She was looking through him, most of that. It's a good thing I like climbing. Now, if everyone who's dying is coming back because something's wrong with hell, couldn't Baldur also come back? Yeah. Maybe a trip to hell. Oh, thank Amir. Clear him sense, right. clear senses. How did it go? I was starting to think. Sindri, I told you I could handle it, but I don't think she's gonna help us. Ah, uh, where's your necklace? Huh? Oh, I was thinking, and I uh, got rid of it. She took it, didn't she? Uh, Today was your lucky day. So, tell me, how did it feel to run on chaos? I... Oh, hi, big boy. I just fixed that! <laughs> yeah, I like how it skips stones. <laughs> oh, you can even charge that one. That's not where I was aiming, Sindri, you crazy, you crazy guy. I'll repair it later. Let's get out of here before something else tries to kill us. Yeah, good idea. Hate to bring it up, but are we telling your dad about this? Since you've come clean and all. No way. He'd kill you. Right. Well. Speaking of coming clean, I need your opinion on something. What? Something I've kept from my brother for a long time. What is it? I'll tell you on the way back. Come on. Uh. Oh. Uh. Do you have trouble with hills, injury? Uh. Uh. Are they ever quit? Oh, that one. Is it because I shot it as it was firing? Is that why it died instantly? Huh. No, they just seem to die really easily. Okay, back to Alfheim Tower. You were saying? Long before you were born, there was an accident at the forge. Brock died. Yeah, that's why he's blue. I couldn't accept it. I went to the Lake of Souls in Alfheim to steal him back. Legions of souls tried to stop me. I can still feel them crawling all over my skin. Thing is, I could only get three of his four soul parts back. Sindri, 
Brock just thought he got knocked out. I've been lying to him ever since. It's been eating at me lately. You have to tell him. He has a right to know. When the time is right. As should you with your father. Are we gonna not get the, same the last thing. piece of rock soul? Well, that explains why he's blue. It wasn't because of the silver theory. It's he did indeed die. Isn't there like he got his head cut off or something like that? Really? Now? Watch your ankles. What is Sindri throwing at these guys? Bye. Oh, that that one I like the like skipping stone bomb. That thing's cool. Anyway, you did a good thing. You saved Brock's life. I caused trouble. No, I made a choice. One that wasn't mine to make. Hmm. What do you mean, a choice? I. I couldn't be alone. The other dwarves, when they saw him, they shunned us. So we left. Made our own home. Well, you can't change the past, but it doesn't have to be who you are. Let's go home before Father wakes up. That might be the best idea you've had all night. Trey. Trey? It's an... Shut up. What? What? Well... We were having a nice moment there. Nice handle. Oh, wait. I thought we were going down. So I'm not allowed to give you a nickname? Is that what that was? <laughs> Whatever, Loke. Nope. That was worse. Oh, and I heard it when I said it. All right. Shall we? I guess we shall. Well, this was a fun little excursion, diversion. Distraction. We are gonna open the door, and Kratos is gonna be on the other side at one I hate point. coming home empty-handed. After Tyr was such a failure, just wanted now to. Now hang on, little Jotun. Tyr may not be everything you expected, but a failure. You saved him from a terrible fate. That's not nothing. And hey, maybe he'll be some help to us yet. Maybe, but Father's not gonna go along with this forever. He's probably already got our next hiding place all picked out. Well, let's not make it worse by getting caught. When we get there, I'll cover our tracks at the gateway and slip around back. And you just act natural, but quickly. This is gonna be something. Go, go, go. Oh. How did. Wow. Even out of a cutscene, he can do it. That is not the risk that concerns me. Do we trust the path they would put us on? I trust their wisdom, and this is the closest thing to hearing directly from them. You are certain the giants would not counsel war? I said that they were wise. In my experience, that goes with being peaceful. Oh, little brother. Told you we needn't worry. Atreus, where have you been? Peen? Hope you're all hungry. I could eat. Is everyone as well rested as I am? Be right down. Does Mimir eat? Is this sausage? Uh, sure. Why not? I remember food tasting better. I suppose you'd like to try cooking for this lot. I accept. What? What? Uh. Atreus, where are I planning our next move? Oh, so where are we going? Alfheim. I'm with the elves. Alfheim? You hate Alfheim. Why would we move there? Move there? Oh, we are. Seeking information. 
The shrine of Groa, young one. Your father tells me you found it there. Groa? The knowledge keeper? Oh, maybe there's a secret there I can unlock. Aye. Who better than the seer who saw everything? I wasn't sure you, um... Never mind. That's great. Have fun. Hey, don't go forgetting this what'll get you there. What? You know what? I'm gonna build a bigger table. <laughs> More for me. What is this weird, awkward dinner? <laughs> Here, you're really up for coming with us? I am. Whenever you're ready. Well, whenever your father's ready, I should say. If my counsel might help you towards the answers you seek, it's the least I can do to repay you. Plus, I think it will do me well to see the light of Elfheim again. He's got some color back to him. That elf light is some good shit. This... What is this weird, awkward... So, Jesus, Brock. Where did this plan come from? Oh, from Mimir, of course. I was merely asking how you found me, and he explained the secret prophecies inside the Yodnar shrines. Fascinating. From there, we sent you taking stock of which shrines we'd seen, at which point your father recalled finding drawers outside the Temple of Light. And now that we can actually go to Alfheim, the prudent course of action became self-evident. Nary a last step for the world's smartest man. Even without feet, if you'll forgive the levity. I was always fond of our talks, you know? Aye. And it's good to see you a free man again, old friend. What is ha- this scene is so weird. It's very funny and kind of just like- and thanks to you as well, Brock. These clothes do better than I deserve. Darn straight. And never mind what Brock had to trade the landlord to get that Intrasil seed for his. The landlord? He's not the landlord. <laughs> uh, okay. N well, we are at the roots. Maybe this, maybe Nidhogg? Is Nidhogg nice in this game? It was a big scary poison dragon in Assassin's Creed. How long can I sit here? Wait. And who am I playing as? Is, that, is this going to be the surprise when I get up? I love that Kratos' hand just obscures the plate enough that you can't see how much sausage is in there. Oh, I am Kratos again. I don't even have Mimir on me. That was such a weird... Can I sit back down? Oh. <laughs> oh, so Tyr's going to be cooking, I guess. Oh. Why is this chest full? I haven't left. Ready when you are, Father. Thank you. He really did it. Tyr really slept in my broom closet. Is that normal for you tall, godly sorts? Or just the ones locked up for a lifetime or two? You got anything new? If I don't have it, you don't need it. Special items. And Atreus? Oh. Oh, that's neat. That's not that hard to craft, either. Kratos? Right behind you. I'll meet you at the gateway presently, friends. I mean, Kratos definitely knows something's up with Atreus being gone for so long. But I guess it's probably... Alfheim, I didn't expect we'd be going back. Me, 
sir. <sighs> Mind if I a talking a squirrel? I promise I'll be brief. Could it be Reddit Oscar? My goodness, what a strapping physique. Capable of an astounding variety of acts of violence, I imagine. What is happening? This is the shit talking this squirrel. Must be a squirrel that turns the world tree. That delectable aroma. Could it be? Pardon the intrusion. Mm. Ah, yes. Amber resin. Delightfully nutty with a hint of squid ink. No. Not one for gastronomic expiration, I see. Wait, if you're Radit Hosker, why are you so different when we summon you for help? Yeah. It's a long story. <laughs> but you are correct. I am indeed Radit Hosker. <gasps> I love him. The one you know as Radit Hosker is merely one of my spectral aspects. And a particularly nasty one at that. I consider him so far removed from myself that he's practically a different person. Speaking of... Bitter? Would you like to come out and see your friends? Fuck off! I'm busy! I suppose that was to be expected. Anyway... <clears throat> now that I've polished off all this resin for you, would you like the seed back? It is the seed. Indeed. A seed of Yggdrasil, to be precise. <clears throat> Since my dwarven tenants performed their little reconfiguration, You'll need seeds like these to open up new destinations on my tree. <laughs> Your tree, huh? Yes, my tree. Here, let me show you. Oh, because we got a half a seed from Muspelheim before. So that's why good Master Brock needed an Alfheim seed. Clearly, you have important matters afoot. Alfheim awaits with a long and difficult journey. The training grounds of Niflheim hold secrets. Svartalfheim may hold unfinished business. Choose carefully. Oh. That seed you found unlocks Niflheim of all places. A realm as ancient as it is vaguely sticky. Svartalfheim remains at your disposal. If you have unresolved business amongst the dwarves. Well, I still can't solve some of those puzzles. Huh. I kind of want to see Niflheim. Yet, it's probably best for Tyr to wait for us here. The soldiers we fought in Svartalfheim, those were Enriar? I thought Enriar were just spirits in Valhalla until Ragnar comes. Was it called a Ratatask? No spirits. Indeed, brother. Odin appears to have found a loophole. Activated his forces early as a standing army. Perhaps something he could only do without any honest Valkyries around to stand in his way. So. Favors. No, that's not what I want. Oh, yeah. Travel to Nip. That's weird. Why is it showing eyes? There's a weird overlap, it seems, with objectives there. Has Niflheim Cho? It's got a little colder since we were here last time. Wait, Niflheim. Yeah, that was the realm of fog, Do isn't it? Do we have to be here? Creeping me out, all these poor bastards with their souls cut up. Oh. Wait, are those Odin's ravens? The ones we've been destroying all this time? So it would seem. Free are we. Free of the father. Our half-wise now belong to no other. What do you think that means? I don't know. But there's definitely Does something he make the ravens out of fragments of souls? A 
18, 12. Damn, I need one more. Well, that's spooky. I wonder if we'll find... If they are fragments, will we find Brock's piece? There's something over here. Ah, a memory of war. You could use this as a training arena if you like. You'll just be fighting the recollections of enemies. They won't be able to harm you. Oh, so this would be where you grind out your skills then, right? There's no XP or hack silver gain in the arena. Oh, that's cool. All right. That's good to know. I can always come here if I want to work on upgrading a skill. Nice to have the option. Let's go to Alfheim. Oh, I guess we have to go back to Sindri's house first. Mimir, I know this sounds weird, but can you tell me again what happens when someone dies? Every living thing has a soul, and every soul has four parts. Form, mind, direction, and luck. Direction steers the souls of giants, dwarves, elves, and animals toward the Lake of Souls in Alfheim, where all the parts may be absorbed back into Alfheim's great light. So that's where Fenrir is? The Lake of Souls? So long as his soul still has its direction, aye, it's well on its way. Huh, we gonna revive... Fenrir? So which part is... Which part is Brock missing? Let me untrack that for now. Okay, so Niflheim's cool. Wait. Ah, there you are. I knew you hadn't forgotten me. I thought... Cause isn't Niflheim the land of fog? You know Ratatosker? Master of Kratos, I would speak with you. We were just you. catching up in your absence. Of the squirrels I've conversed with, he's easily the most dapper. Yeah, but he's a he's a shit talker. He travels between Nidhogg and the Eagle at the top talking shit. Speak. If you are ever in need of my services and I am not present, I have installed these handy chimes for you to notify me. Simply throw your axe and strike the chimes, and I will attend to your needs. Would you care to take a practice throw? A magnificent throw, Master Kratos. Truly a seasoned pro. Very well. You know how to reach me now. <sighs> I have a question. What a splendid! I delight in offering my tutelage to the Inquisitive. Over the ledge, by the gateway over there. I noticed these dragons. Dragons? Oh no, young Master Atreus. Those are leaned worms, the brood of Neithhoad. Neithhoad? That's how you say Neith Neithhoad? Neithhoad? Correct. She's also a vital piece of the Yggdrasilian circle of life, as it were. I tend the branches up here, while Neithhoad chews the roots from below to prevent overgrowth. A delicate balance. So they're friendly? Well, they're not nearly so affable as myself, but there's no reason to expect hostility so long as they're left in peace. Neithhoad is a stern matriarch. As protective of her offspring as she is determined to teach them proper discipline. That sounds... Familiar. Hmm. <laughs> Acknowledging grunt. Should I have anything else for you, you'll be the first to know. Okay, well, you're delightful. And probably a... Su the mushroom people! I had forgotten about them. You ready to go, chief? Going back to Alfheim, I guess. So we have we never went to Asgard. We went to Jotunheim at the end of the last game. We have been to Muspelheim. That's the like end game grind. Svartalfheim was new. Helheim we went to. Niflheim we went to. Vanaheim we never went to. So Vanaheim, Asgard, and Svartalfheim are the three that weren't in the last one. And we've gone to one of them so far, so that's promising. 
a long journey awaits. Perhaps as we travel, you can tell me the tale of your prior visit to the land of the elves. Sure, I can. Oh, I wonder what's happened since we were there last. Cause did we stop that war there? It kind of seems like it was going Our on indefinitely. The first time we ever roam traveled using your temple. Freya tried coming with us, but Odin cast a spell on her. She can't leave Midgard. That's terrible. So then we fought our way through an army of Dark Elves to get to the light. You interfered in the Elf War. Not by choice. We sought to fill our Bifrost, and they attacked us. And the Dark Elves were covering it with their sticky hive stuff. When we freed it, the Light Elves came back. They seemed better in Alfheim. <laughs> Did they now? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Alfheim. Been so long. Not sure where the temple is from here, but that's where we'll find Groa Shrine. Uh oh. Broken history. Aye, not exactly an easy fix for that. Graffiti in Dark Elf territory next to a statue of their ancestors. The elves before the division of light and dark. The message begin. What exact being? What exactly? And for who? If the elves have seen the statue and ignored it, or they're more concerned with the mastery over the light. Right, because the Dark Elves are like buggy, kind of. Not glitchy, like actual insects. See the elves continue their war. Yeah. So much for things being better in Alpha. Oh. These are Dark Elves, aren't they? Yeah, because they're impaled by light swords. Yeah, are we going to fight light elves this time? Winter hit Alfheim hard. No. Storms have plagued Alfheim's deserts long before Fimble winter. The desert? Oh, this is... We didn't go to this part of Alfheim. How is Tyr going to fit through this? Hold on. Oh. I hear something out there. Something big. It's in pain. This is spooky. Like, legitimately spooky. Our goal is at the temple, not in the desert. All right, everybody, just keep showing off. There, the Temple of Light. Groa's shrine is at the top. Wait, I didn't Freyr know. never bothered returning to Alpine, did he, Mimir? I know. Freyr? I assumed the fate of his own realm took precedence. Wait, Freyr's brother? Yes. Cut from a different cloth, that one. Be if I was Brazier. At least these seem to stay lit. Up oh, there it is. Is everything okay? Hi, old friend. Just looting Normia's chests. We'll be right along. My dad likes loot. <laughs> My dad likes loot. Ah, very well. Oh, I can't go back up that way. Oh. Okay, see, it was worth going back. Oh, I got pushed off the edge and I kind of just walked off. These are dark elves that are all dead. That's a light elf. Huh. It'll be interesting if we end up fighting Light Elves, if that really is the twist here. So neither party is good. Purple. There's a barricade up ahead. What are those shiny rocks? Twilight Stone. A rare material that can take millennia to form. Majestic, isn't it? Occasionally, the light of Alfheim will bind to a rock and crystallize, 
growing like moss on a fallen tree. Truly a wonder of the Nine Realms. Wait, I've got to reflect it? over there cool that's a new one so it seems like it's a fixed very clever it seems like it's a fixed angle these things will reflect at come here I gotta pull you to me That was new. You look pale again. Freya's brother. How was he involved? Long ago, Freya of the Vanir traveled to Alfheim, where he discovered a once beautiful land devastated by war. Using his divine powers, he set about cultivating a tenuous peace among the elves. And, and then? Oh, how did you get there? Did you mention how that peace fell apart as soon as he left? I was getting to it. Did you hear that? Oh, no. That's enough, please. You don't need to do this. <laughs> We don't want to hurt you. We do not have a choice. Come here, man. No! Whoa! Was that a bomb? No! No! Yep, the light elves are bad this time. They're the ones who bring the light. Let me see how that... Before I... I think I didn't do that one completely yet, right? Uh, no. It's this one. No. No. This one. Oh, I still can do it a ton of times. Full attack. Interesting. Most unfortunate. They attacked us. More will follow once we're inside. Is there truly not like they're giving us much of a choice? So your father said. Just naive, I suppose. No. Just an optimist, old friend. Is there gonna be a snapping point for Tyr where like he goes back into violent frenzy? Ooh, again with the glowy rock. Tribute to Freya, made by the elves. He must have left it here when he raced back to Vanaheim. What is this? A charm to ward off nightmares. In this case, flares. Well, knowing the elves, there are probably more tributes to find. Best we move on for now, brother. I don't think we have the right tools for this one. I'm gonna keep trying. All right. All right, so this time is light elves. Interesting. It's so tall. We came in from the top last time. I didn't realize all this was even down here. It's an older gate, built to promote cooperation between the elves. But it looks like it's been sealed for some time. How do we enter? Grab that wheel and I'll show you. Will you be grabbing the other one? I'll go first. Atreus, let me know when I've reached halfway. So, uh, what's happening right now? This seal is meant to represent the balance of the realm when Freyr was here. Light and dark, working together in harmony. How's that look, Atreus? Good, I think. Father. Unfortunately I... for Alfheim, Freyr couldn't accept his sister's decision to marry Odin. He returned to Vanaheim and left this realm to its fate. To be fair, the Aesir did set him on fire that one time. Cool. Hmm. The door should have opened. Are you sure it's balanced? 
Yeah, but the realm isn't. Not anymore. Father, try pulling it the other way. Yeah, yeah. And Tyr, you keep pushing forward. Oh, we need it to be all light instead of dark. Fine work, Atreus. Shall we? Oh, yeah, last time we came through it was like infested and buggy and full of hives and stuff. Now it's all plants, it seems. What's a Dark Elf statue doing in the Light Temple? That's just how they looked before the Division. The Division? Yes. The Elves weren't always split between light and dark, you know. This statue depicts the Elves before the war, before they discovered the power of the light. Huh. Oh god, are we fighting a Dark Souls boss? Yes. The stone briefly imparts a bit of light to your axe. That's useful. Oh, is the, is the trajectory actually like... Oh, it is like actually calculated. Whew. That's going to be complicated. Guess I should be using the axe for this part. What's that sound? No sense in spoiling the surprise. Never seen the Lake of Souls so volatile. Aye, Fimple Winter, you reckon? Of course, making the light unstable. So the base of this light well, that's the Lake of Souls. Yes. After the creation of the Nine Realms, fallen souls began to gather down in those waters. When the Elves discovered its potential, they built this temple to harness that energy. A smashing success, to say the least. Many of them became addicted to their newfound power. And thus, the Light Elves were born. Ugh. Oh, so the Light Elves were evil. Oops. Oops. Huh. That looks important. No, nope, never mind, they're all over. <laughs> ah, you can see when it's the right angle. Well done. Though I imagine our Light Elf friends will be less than pleased. That's a cool mechanic. Ooh, lovely music. I mean, this is beautiful. I'm sure it's not going to last, but... There's a certain serenity to it. Speaking of Light Elves... Let me try talking to them again. They Best may... just to let these two do their thing, brother. One of those light bombs! Careful! <laughs> Enemy on the left. Oh, the axe like honed in on it. You know, I don't know if there's actually a skill for that. I should check that. Just work on my skills. Uh. Yeah. Okay, so there is. God, that one needs to be done 50 times. Oh, you're super dead. My condolences. Poor souls. Came across on light bridges, but now the bridges are gone. 
I have an idea to get us across. You're going to have to toss me. Or he's going to toss us. Lucky for us, swearing off violence doesn't mean he can't disfigure some architecture. This way, the shrine awaits. Oh, I missed the whole cool thing he did. All right, all right, Zelda did it first. Kratos, where are you going? He's just looking around. He does this sometimes. Curious <laughs> mind. I love that they're commenting on like the way players play these games. That's very amusing. Is that where we came in from? I think so, right? Yeah, and then we fought. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Since our. looks so different than I remember. It was all broken and covered in hive stuff last time we were here. These elves use elf hive to enhance the temple and themselves by the look of it. They definitely look more dangerous than last time. Oh, those were just the foot soldiers. Oh. They'll get more dangerous the further up we go. Great. Wait, how do I... How do I get down to that one? That looks like I'm going to loop around at some point. Alright. So if these elves use the light to build doors and make themselves stronger, what do the Dark Elves want with it? To return it back to its source. To them, the natural resources of Alfheim are sacred, none more so than the light itself. Aye, the light elf's success came at a terrible price. Alfheim's once lively desert withered into a storm-ridden wasteland soon after the creation of this temple. Hello, secrets. What are you? Oh, a collectible. What became of Kavazir? Ripped apart by his audience. Well, one member of the audience. Well, Thor. Visions after rest. And which... And which Vir Kvasir provides readers with their own tools for crafting stories. Oh, it's, um... Oh, what's the game? Meaty Molecule. Is it Dreams or Dream? I don't remember. Visions after rest, laying wait for explorers, crafted by the imps and filled with music, joy, or horror. Among these fanciful realms lie endless creation and possibilities where the limit is one's own imagination. Oh, I think I, I guess I missed two in Svartalfheim. Wait a minute. Oh, what do you do, good sir? Oh, wait. More light elves ahead. I'll handle this. Uh, maybe that's not a great idea. Oh, was I just supposed to go that way? Never mind. I thought I was being clever. Oh there, friends. Salutations. We mean you no harm. Here. Get back. How dare you dodge my attack? Get the light over. Hold still, I need to upgrade my skill. Nice block. Oh, you can block it. How about the head? Nope. The head is not blockable. Oh, I knocked your mask off. At least I tried. I get it now. Why they keep fighting? Dark Elves want the souls in the light left alone. The Light Elves want to keep using them. That's the long and short of it. Well, that would have been nice to know last time we were here. Which side is right? Rarely is it so simple. Not our place to say. This is an Elven conflict. 
I said as much the last time we were in Alfheim. Right. <laughs> really just driving that home, huh, Kratos? I keep forgetting Ice Spartan Rage. Getting a nice big intro to something here? No, just a staircase. Alright, well, I guess we're gonna keep climbing and there's gonna be some big reveal of some kind, I'm sure. But I say oh, I wonder if this is gonna end with end with us saving Fenrir somehow. Hmm, that's if now that's it for now though. Ugh. So thanks for joining me. Come back, I'll have the next stuff up real soon, but until then. Bye.